Now, in order for us to be able to take this artwork and move it somewhere else in the document, we need to, of course, be able to select it. Now, with my selection tool active from the top of the tools panel, if you recall, just to the side of the artwork we wish to select, click and hold down the mouse and drag across that region to select all of the objects. At least that's the theory. Now, that sometimes what happen because elements are locked. Now, you'll notice here that it selected the hair, it selected the facial features, and it's also selected the backpack, but it hasn't allowed us to select the body, the ears and the head. So why is that? Well, if we take a look at the layers panel, you'll notice that we have a column that relates to locking. And some of those elements have a padlock symbol adjacent to them. Elements like the ears, the body and the head. So if I was to try and hover my cursor over the body and left click, well, it completely ignores it and it selects whatever's behind it which is selectable, which is the backpack. So in order for us to be able to select those elements, we'll have to unlock them. So if I take my cursor and hover over the padlock symbol here, left click, it disappears. And now the body will be selectable. If I click on the padlock for the head, that will also now be unlocked. It is also possible to unlock everything on your artboard. Now, if I go up to the object menu, you can choose unlock all. And when I do that, it will unlock everything on this artboard and it usually selects it as well. So you'll notice that the only thing that was left that was locked are the two ears left and right. Now I'll click away and then what we can do is hover our cursor just to the side, click and hold down the mouse and drag across that region to select them. Everything has now been activated that we wish to utilize. And again, it would be prudent at this point to group everything together. So if I go to the object menu, go down to group and you'll notice that all of those separate elements that we saw a minute ago have now been included in a new element called group. I'm not going to rename it this time. It's not really a good habit to get into all the time. But if I click on the toggle, I can show you that in part that inside of that group, we have the backpack, the head, the body, the face, the hair and the ears. So it's everything that we need. Again, I'll collapse that and then click away. I'm going to pick up my zoom tool, hover over, hold down the mouse and left click to be able to see both artboards. And then I can go back to the selection tool, hover over and left click and it selects everything in that group. And I can then drag and move that across to the other artboard and position it just here like so. So that's how you can unlock elements inside of your document.